Okay. Um, do you feel like there's too many platforms out there as far as um, trying to do your job without the professional training? There are a lot of coaches who do good work, and it's really up to the public to be the ones that decipher amongst quality. In every industry, you got people who aren't trained doing a job. But as a consumer, it's your job to do the research. You shouldn't just trust anybody. And there are a lot of coaches out there who are working just to give out information on Instagram and Facebook, and they make their money that way. They make their money on likes. They make their money on how many people view their videos. So, I mean, in, in slang terms, I'm not going to hate on anybody's ability to submit positive material. I think it's the, the, the public's responsibility. If you're going to pay someone that no, with no degree, no training to work on your relationship, then, then that's, that's on you. That shouldn't be on the, the person doing it. I mean, therapists are licensed not for us. We're licensed for the public. My license tells any consumer that I've gone through a set of standards to be able to work with you around your relationship. If you choose to go to someone because they got a lot of followers on Instagram with no license and there's nothing that's validated that they've done the work or been trained, I'm not going to knock that person. That's the consumer's responsibility, not the person trying to make some money and a living.